congregation in Norfolk wants to know who shot up their church. And no one was hurt after the gunfire Thanksgiving night at Mount Hermon Baptist Church on Lynn's Avenue. But Tenor Inside's Mighty Lena Ballores is here to show us the extensive and costly property damage. Yeah, from what we saw, there were at least eight shots fired into the church on Thanksgiving. The pastor thinks it'll cost thousands to fix. Uh, the church's pastor told me that on Wednesday, the praise and worship group was rehearsing in the sanctuary. On Thursday, nobody was there. Friday, a church maintenance worker stopped by to drop off supplies and immediately was shocked by what he saw. It was a call that surprised Pastor Stephen Lewis. Windows shot out, doors shot out. The sanctuary he calls home hit with gunshots Thursday night. We don't know why it happened. I don't know if we were targeted. He learned the news Friday morning. Now seeing that the bullets came through the outer glass door, shattered it, and then hit the inner wooden door. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and I'm assuming eight because the panel was shot out as well. Some even flew through the sanctuary, hitting a flower arrangement, leaving marks on the pulpit and the community. This is supposed to be a place, uh, a safe haven. This is supposed to be a place uh, where we can worship in peace and feel the love of God and the peace of God. And to think that somebody would come in and do something like this to the house of God is just repulsive. Church maintenance employee William Taylor was the first to see the bullet holes, shocked and angered by what happened. This is a holy ground, you know. This is the house of the Lord and be vandalized like that is just unheard of. He immediately called Norfolk police who are investigating. They stopped by Sunday to make sure the community was safe. Their presence was felt here uh, because naturally some of our worshipers, uh, they were a little leery about attending worship service on Sunday morning. Now they're hoping someone can bring them answers. You never think that something like this uh, would happen in your own backyard. To give them peace. Pastor Lewis says they have security cameras in the back lo parking lot of the church. They now plan to install new ones in the front of the church. Anybody with information is asked to call the Norfolk Crime Line. I'm Marilena Belores, 10 on your side.